Good morning, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. So, it is Sunday morning and just letting you guys see our Sunday morning routine. We're actually getting ready to go to church. Yeah, come say hi. Put your clothes up, mommy. Let me let y'all see what she has on. Hi. Say good morning. Say good morning. Good morning. How are you? How are you? Have a good day. Have a good day. <laughs> yeah, so we're, um, Isaiah's still getting dressed. So we're going to have a little breakfast while we wait on him. But you, y'all, good morning. Welcome back to the vlog. Come sit down. We're having a Burger King. Come here. Come on, let me help you. Yeah, we're having Burger King for breakfast. My battery is low. Here, let's see what we have. Cheese. I got some hash browns. And some fish sauce. Y'all, they only gave us one syrup for nine French toast sticks. I'm just gonna deal with it. That one syrup should be enough. Because, uh, y'all, Rancy and Isaiah are aggravating us. I can never watch TikTok around Isaiah because Isaiah doesn't understand TikTok. Like, it's not funny to him. He's, I don't really be on TikTok. And then he just told me, I said, oh, this is funny, Isaiah. Look, he gonna say, it's Sunday. Put that away. Like, they, they, they don't stop uploading because it's Sunday? I don't want to listen to that. I Isaiah, listen to what? Gospel music on. Yeah, yeah, we can listen to gospel music and TikToks. Okay. It's funny stuff on TikToks. Gospel music is not always funny. I need a giggle. I need a laugh. Laughing is therapeutic. Yeah, right yes, right now. <laughs> yeah, you act like a forty-year-old man. Not right now. Turn that TikTok off. It's Sunday. No, I gotta get. You can watch it. You happy now? Isaiah. <laughs> How was church? Church was cool. Y'all make sure y'all go to church. Get some God. No, 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 no. I want to know you. about get the some word. God what you. was the word? I want to know how you. Get some God in you. Ain't about um, that. Like, I, it was kind of, it was hard for was, me. The lady was kind of all over the place. She kind of talked a lot. She talked a lot. The pastor. And I was looking, I was trying to feel, you know, the anointing. People can preach, but everybody don't hold the same anointing. So, yeah, that's what I was feeling because we we listened to um yeah when, on the way to um on the way to church we had listened to like a sermon by what's the guy Michael somebody and um huh PMJ oh well PMJ and Michael. that see that word was like. 
it was a word that was given that didn't sound judgmental okay so i was able to easily receive that word versus the word that was given today i caught myself like battling not being upset about what she was saying it, it was kind of hard to receive like i was kind of like okay well she doesn't mean it that way i you know like i'm trying to understand how she's meaning it the pastor was meaning no. it but all right now hey um yeah it's i can't explain it Y'all, Isaiah is out the car, but what I'm trying to say is that when somebody delivers a message, I feel like they need to be mindful. Like, it it should be delivered in a way where it's not sounding as if someone is being attacked, someone is being judged. Because the way that message was delivered, there was no empathy in it. You know, it was just a lot of judgment. The lady was just like talking about homosexuality and things like that but she didn't throw in there but god still loves them the, these people or all these sins that people were doing she never once came back get in the court royalty and sent a reminder that god still loves these people and that they still are within his grace and that's just my thing now they're going to have to be delivered from shame, from guilt. Because I know a lot of my depression, like it hit home for me because I know, I, y'all know I went through a depression. And a lot of my depression was from shame and guilt. And having somebody talk like that would just have me in the same place that I was at. They go to donuts. So anyway, we're getting ready to go to this cat cafe. Our, you left the key in us? We got the donuts that Isaiah got for me uh for us from um brunettes and we're gonna go ahead and eat them yesterday we had so much food um i ain't even show y'all the food that we got from um main event the little um, arcade place we went to but we ate there so we're getting ready to go to this cafe and i'm gonna have some um coffee and royalty's gonna see the cat she, she's gonna love it wait till y'all get there it's, it's it's the cutest little thing y'all gonna love it hold on <laughs> We're at the cat cafe. We gotta Oh yeah, I think I got one in the car. Hello. How are you guys? Never better, how are you? Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna like do uh, um 360 at a place so you guys can get a look around it. It's in Cleveland um, in the Tremont area I think this would be that area but if you want to visit it's definitely I think so far worth a visit. We haven't even gotten, went to the cat lounge but I can see through the window and I, it's, it looks like it's going to be worth the visit. Hey, hi. 
Some pretty eyes there. Richie, don't put it in his face. Kitty cat said that's nice. See, it likes it. Look. Yeah, you drew the That's nice, royalty. Did a good job, royalty. Here a little outfit. The um, yes, yeah, the wood. Yeah. So he took it off to ship it because he moved here from LA. And um, he just kept So we just stopped by an uh, art gallery. We're actually on our way to go get something to eat. I think we're going to try Indian food tonight, but they don't open until probably like another 15 minutes. So we decided to stop by this art gallery. Um, that we've been trying to stop by, but it's always kind of closed. We always miss it, but we happen to catch it today. And there's some really nice art in here. I'm going to let y'all see. Very pretty. Yellow. Where's the yellow? What other color is it? Hmm? You're going to paint one this big? It's huge. Isaiah, you, paint, you went to one sip and paint, and you didn't lost your mind. Understand how good I am at this. Like, all right, I'm gonna paint you. Let's go. Cool. Y'all, Isaiah went to one sip and paint, and he hey. is inspired. Oh, He's an artist now. Busy. He's an artist now. She ain't never seen my artwork. That's the crazy part about it. She don't even he know. He went to one sip and paint. He's why he's about to do a portrait hey, of me. Hey, Cleveland. Y'all know I get busy. Yeah. It's pe hey, the people that know what's up. Tag her. Let her. Let her know what's up. I get busy on the art Wait, side. Don't nobody know what's up. He do one sip and paint, and he done. <laughs> get busy you, on you, the art. You wild. I get busy on the art side. Hey, stay humble. Don't get. I'm just playing. Stay I'm just playing, babe. You did real good at your sip and paint. They was like, oh, we got the pro here showing out. I was like, y'all, please don't. Don't, don't. Please stop. <laughs> don't please stop. That. Please stop. Don't stroke, I'm his, okay. don't stroke I, his ego. Please don't I, do I'm it. Don't okay. do it. I'm, I'm humble. I'm very humble. Very. But I'm about to get busy. Color cut like I like I make sure. Yes, what did he say? Tell us he about said, this artwork. He says out of Hong Kong, the one on the right is at the airport. And then this one was doing the riot in Hong Kong. Mm -hmm. The Hong and Kong he riot. Him up and he did it when uh, LA was in quarantine. And these are acrylic. Mm -hmm. With, with uh, mixed oil in there too. Some oil in there too. Okay. So we made it to um, the Indian restaurant. We're getting ready to have something to eat right quick. Okay, so we started our order with samosas, uh, which is that triangle item there and it's just a uh, savory pastry stuffed with potato and peas uh, green peas and some mild seasoning and it comes with a tamarind sauce and a cilantro dipping sauce and then here we have pretty pretty uh, penny pretty and it's just another type of uh, savory puff pastry that's filled with chickpeas traditionally chickpeas potatoes and <clears throat> onions 
um, this one is just chickpeas and onions and it comes with a broth um, sometimes several broths but this one only came with one and you just fill it up you see it doesn't leak through it's a pretty sturdy uh, pastry even though it looks very delicate you fill it with broth or other ingredients um, but yeah here they only had just those three ingredients for this um, penny pretty and then I ordered the lamb vindaloo there's the basmati rice and Isaiah ordered chicken something I forgot <laughs> but it was good oh man don't start Isaiah <laughs> <laughs> He about to paint any and everything. How was the food? Oh, man, the food was good. Y'all gotta try Indian delight. Indian delight. But okay, was that your first time having Indian food? Um, second time. Yeah. Who you had Indian food with? I thought uh, you said you never had it. Years ago in the business. Uh, uh -huh. Yeah, they said I couldn't pick no more it was, restaurants. It was sweets though. It was like a. I had like a, a loaf. It's like a Indian loaf. Or something like oh, okay. Oh, is that why you were trying to try the desserts? I don't. I'm not really a fan of Indian desserts, so I skipped out on desserts. Plus, we still got a whole half dozen of donuts at the house. That's the size of my head. Each one's the size of my head. So, yeah, I skipped out on dessert today. The day is over. The sun's going down. What a day! We had two great days. Bro too great the weekend was we had a good weekend just getting started man. Just, just getting started just getting what does started. that mean just getting started what does that mean anyways i think i'm gonna end the vlog here make sure y'all like comment subscribe all that good stuff it's been real i'm gonna see y'all on the next vlog until next time, y'all be easy.